One late entry, just in. Ah, uh, Val. <laughs> it might surprise you. Uh, proposals, projection... Customer care? See TripAdvisor? If she can't even be bothered to fill out the form... Val and Eric aren't proper business people, Dad. In fact, they're all funny little cottage industries that do things their way. <sighs> so that's to be my legacy, is it? Mm -hmm. Supporting a gift emporium in Demdike run by hippies. Oh, I, don't know. I may as well cancel today and give it another six months. Yeah, well, then your reputation really will be shot. Why don't you just pick one? I need to go make sure the press are coming. Uh, you should take a leaf out of my book. Support local business without making a show of it. What's that? Payment from the scrapyard. <laughs> yeah, for the half year. Huh? Quarter? Where there's mucky metal, there's brass. And these two seem to have it sorted. Is there any way at all that we can keep Novak out of it? Not unless the lawyer was writing itself. This isn't Harry Potter, Jimmy. You're not covered as simple as that. Neither is any civil penalty, which could be £10,000. Great. Glad I bought you that pint. Your best option is to be straight with the police and get ready for a big financial hit. I'll tell him. The woman from the courier is getting twitchy. She's covering Brenda's due as well, so... Oh, great. Upstaged by a seesaw. Mm. Right. The hour is upon us. Sure. There is one clear winner. A local success story here in Emmerdale. Started by two enterprising young men who saw a business venture and went for it. <laughs> Won't do that, is. So, on behalf of Holy Scrap, Aaron, would you please step forward to accept your award? Be <laughs> kept back quiet. Oh, tell me about it. Yeah, uh, cheers for this. Um, drinks on me, then. <laughs> <laughs> Joking, obviously. Mm. We are going to put it back into the business. Um, we've got our eye on a, on a crusher. Won't bore you with that, though. So, cheers for this. Mm. I hadn't even entered this morning. Is that your idea, financing one of your robbery thugs? It's the first I'd heard about it. I know it's not the most glamorous choice, but the scrapyard's a family business already. Oh, it's hardly family. Robert just gave them a couple of grand. Yeah, which was a shrewd investment, as is this. With my money and mentoring, they'll go from strength to strength. Congratulations. So I've got you to thank of her. I didn't say a word. Lawrence really likes you. This could be good for us all. Well, we all know what you want out of it. It's not me you're getting into bed with this time. This gives you money, prestige, normals, clout. Don't be a prat and blow it. 